Welcome to Sada Learning Hub. You are with me, Sada Shivrao. Before going to the video, please subscribe Sada Learning Hub and click on bell button to get latest updates. Now, moving to the video. In this video, I am going to discuss Google Cloud Platform Computing Architecture how the Google Cloud architecture is. I'm going to discuss in this video. See here, this is the Google Cloud architecture. See in this Google Cloud architecture, there's a different components are there. Compute engine, it is comes under IAS. IAAS means infrastructure as a platform. Next coming to the Kubernetes, Kubernetes engine, it is in a high bridge. App engine, it comes under platform as a service. Next, cloud functions, these are all serverless logic. And coming to the managed services, means automated elastic resources. There is a, so many services are providing by the Google. These are all managed services. Now here, I am going dig into more what exactly the IAAS means infrastructure as a platform and PAAS platform as sorry infrastructure as a service and PAAS platform as a service now see Visualized data centers brought you infrastructure as a service and platform as a service offers. Infrastructure as a service offers provides a raw compute storage and a network and organized in a way that are familiar from the data centers. If you see, it is going to manage hardware, virtual server spaces, load balancers, cloud hostings data centers and all those things coming to the pass pass offers on the other hand bind application code you write to the libraries that gives access to your infrastructures to your application needs whatever the application you are going to go we are going to do just we can bind Just you can bind your application code you write to your libraries that give access to infrastructures to your applications. After writing the code, we need to push into the infrastructure as a service. In, in the infrastructure as a service, there is a hosting service or there, hardware, so hardware is there, data centers is there. We need to push that code. That is gives under platform as a service. Now, if you fulfill these both, you can just focus on your application logic. In the infrastructure as a service model, you can pay what you allocate. See, in the infrastructure as a service, we can use, you can pay what you can allocate. See, for example, if you are using the data centers, if you are allocated with the data centers, you can pay for data centers. If you are allocated to cloud hosting, you can pay for only cloud hosting. But coming to the pass, platform as a service model, you pay what you use. For example, if you are using the OS, just you can use for OS only. How much time you are going to use? You can use that much time. If you are using the software, 1 hour or 2 hours or 5 hours or 10 hours. How much time you are going to use? You can pay that much time only, that much hours. You no need to pay extra hours. See simple, infrastructure as a service, you pay for what you allocate. Coming to the platform as a service, you pay for what you use. Both sure beat the old way where you bought everything in advice advance based on lots of risky forecasting as a cloud computing as a world the momentum 
has shifted towards the managed infrastructures and managed services. In the cloud, you no need to do anything. Infrastructure is going to manage and we are going to manage the services. GCP offers many services in which you need not worry about any resources provisioning at all. No need to worry about the services. GCP is providing more and more services. We will discuss many on this coming videos. There is easy to build into your application and you can pay for use. For example, if you are building your application to the GCP, where you are using, what you are taking, you can pay only those. What you are using, you can pay only for those. No need to pay extra. By the way, that's okay. We are good to know. We are known. Infrastructure as a platform and sorry, infrastructure as a service and platform as a service. What about SAAS? Software as a service. S A S S S A A S means software as a service. Of course, Google popular applications like search, Gmail, Docs, and Drive are software as a service applications. In that, there are a consumer directly over the internet by the end users. Whatever the softwares we are going to consume by using the internet those are comes under software as a service right now finally you got three points here infrastructure as a service and platform as a service infrastructure as as a service offers a provide a raw compute software Stories and a network organized in a way that you are familiar from the data centers. Infrastructure as a service model, you pay for what you allocate. Coming to the platform as a service, platform as a service offer offers. On the other hand, bind applications code you, you write to libraries that you access to the infrastructure your application needs. In the platform as a service model, you pay for what you use and coming to the software as a service whatever the services you are going to use like as a software this comes under software as a service gcp google is providing gmail drive all these are software as a services that's about this video thank you guys thank you for watching this video Please, if you like this video, click on like button and share this video. Thank you very much. Thank you so much watching this video. Hope this lesson helpful to you. Keep watching our lessons. Keep writing to us. Do not forget subscribe our channel Sadot Learning Hub because we have many sessions that would help you to develop our skills. And I will be back soon till then you take care. Bye bye.